students welcome to age.med guru classes today we shall discuss discuss some important problems for exam limit by using a hospital rule so this problem given if limit x tends to 0 sin twice x plus p sin x by x cube is finite find the value of p and hence the limit now solution So we consider let L equal to limit x tends to 0 sin twice x plus p sin x by x cube this one where L is finite this is finite. So this, if we putting the limit directly, then we get sin 0, 0, this is 0, this is 0, this is 0 by 0 form, which is 0 by 0 by 0 form. Using L hospitals rule. we get L equal to limit x tends to 0 this is 3 x square 2 cos twice x plus p cos x. So we get this. Now again if we putting directly limit then this will be 0 this is 2 cos 0 is 1 2 plus p we get 2 plus p by 0 but the limit is this is finite that means this will be finite if numerator equal to 0 but limit but limit is finite originally initially given this limit is finite therefore therefore numerator numerator must be zero so limit finite means numerator must be zero Hence, so therefore what you get 2 plus p equal to 0 and p equal to minus 2 we get p equal to minus 2. Now putting the value of p here now now here we putting the value of p now l equal to limit x tends to 0 3 x square this is 2 cos twice x p means 2 cos x we get this the value of p we get minus 2 we get this now again if we putting the limit then cos 0 1 this is 1 2 minus 2 0 this is 0 which is 0 by 0 form using or applying using L hospitals rule we get L equal to limit x tends to 0 this is twice x then 6x if we differentiate the dx of cos means minus sign then this will be 4 twice x this is minus sign twice x into 2 then this is 4 and this is the dx of cos means minus sign so this is we get 
this. Again, if we putting directly limit, then this is 0, this is 0, this is 0, which is 0 by 0 form. Again, using L hospitals rule. we get L equal to limit x tends to 0, this is ddx of x is 1, this is 6 and ddx of sin x means cos x but here 2x, 2 cos x, then this will be 8 cos twice 6 and this is 2 cos x we get, we get this one and putting the limit, this is 6 cos 0 is 1, cos 0 1, this is 8 minus 8 plus 2 minus 6 by 6, this will be minus 1. Therefore, the value of P is, therefore, P equal to, we get minus 2 and the limit is minus 1. This is the final answer. Value of the limit, this is minus 1 and the value of P is minus 2. Is the final answer. Consider another most important problem. Find the values of a and b such that limit x tends to 0, a sin square x plus b log of cos x by x to the power 4 equal to half. This is most important problem. Important to the power infinity. To the power infinity, most important. Now, you consider solution. This one given a uh, half equal to we consider. 1 by 2 equal to limit x tends to 0 x to the power 4 a sin square x plus b log of cos x. So, sin 0 is 0, cos 0 is 1, log 1 is 0, this family is 0 and denominator is 0, which is 0 by 0 form using L hospitals rule we get half equal to limit x tends to 0 4 x cube, ddx of x to the power of 4 x cube, this is a sin square x means 2 sin x into cos x, a ddx of log x means 1 by x, that means 1 by cos x and this is minus, ddx of cos means minus sin. So, this will be limit x tends to 0. 4x cube 2 sin a cos a means sin twice a and sin by cos means 10. Now again if we putting limit this is 0 sin 0 0 tan 0 is 0 and denominator 0 which is 0 by 0 form. Using L hospitals rule, we get half equal to limit x tends to 0, ddx of x cube means 3x square, this is 12x square, and ddx of sin x means cos x, sin twice x means 2 sin cos x, twice a cos twice x, ddx of sin means cos and b ddx of tan x means sec square x. Now if we putting the limit then this will be, if we putting the limit then this will be uh, 0, this is 0, this is twice a minus b cos 0 is 1, sec 0 is 1, so twice a minus b. 
but limit is finite this half given that means limit is minus finite since but limit is finite therefore numerator must be zero therefore what we get twice a minus b equal to zero this is b equal to we get twice a this number one we consider and if putting the value of b is twice a here now half equal to a and this is b b equal to we putting twice a so limit x tends to 0 this is 12 x square and this is uh, twice a cos twice x twice a sec square x just putting the value of b twice a other same this one again if we putting limit cos 0 1 sec 0 1 twice a minus twice a 0 then this is 0 which is 0 by 0 form using L hospitals rule we get using L hospital rule we get half remains same limit x tends to 0 and this is twice a and ddx of cos means minus and twice x means 2 minus 4 a sin twice x twice a and the dx of sec square x means 2 sec x and sec x into 10x and this is 12 into twice x 24x and this implies 1 by 2 equal to limit x tends to 0 24x minus 4a sin twice x 4a sec square x into 10x now again if we putting limit sin 0 is 0 this is 0 sec 0 1 10 0 0 this is 0 so numerator is 0 and 24 into 0 0 which is 0 by 0 form again using L hospitals rule we get we get half 1 by 2 limit x tends to 0 this is 24 ddx of x is 1 minus ddx of sin x means cos x and 2x means 2 minus 8a cos twice x and this is 4a product rule sec square x ddx of 10x means sec square x minus 4a 10x and sec square x means 2 sec x sec x into 10x we get this and if we putting limit denominator is non-zero so putting the limit 24 
minus 8a this is 1 minus 4a this is 1 this is 1 and this is 0 minus 0 we get this and this is 12 uh, 1 by 2 into 24 minus 12a this is 12 equal to minus 12a and a equal to minus 1 we get the value of a is minus 1 and putting the value of a in equation number 1 now 1 implies b equal to 2 into minus 1 this is minus 2 there are 4 a equal to minus 1 b equal to minus 2 and this is our answer very important problem very interesting also thank you